Paying it forward, that's what a South Florida restaurant owner did for a teenager in New York who has a genetic disorder. WPTV News Channel 5's T.A. Walker shows you how the search for an Xbox and social media brought them together for this inspiring story. Jake, left, left, right, right, let's go. 19-year-old Jake Goldberg has a genetic disorder, but that doesn't stop him from enjoying regular teenage hobbies. Uh, my son is an avid gamer. But the arcades on Long Island are closed due to the pandemic. So when Jill heard about the new Xbox gaming controller that was built for people like Jake with special needs, she went to buy one. That's where my problem is. Jill started to panic since the system is in high demand and asked for help on her mom group on Facebook. Nick, a restaurant owner on Long Island, sees Jill's post and asks his friend Kevin Danilo in Miami for help. Never heard of him. have no idea who he was. Kevin buys Jake an Xbox and ships it to New York. <gasps> what is it? Oh! A stranger that we don't even know, Jake, <laughs> sent you a gift hysterically crying. I, I just, I just could not believe this. Life changing for him. Jake now has activities to do with his two sisters. It opens him up to the outside world. Now we got a new buddy. And Christmas Eve happens to be Jake's birthday. So Nick bought him a headset. So when he beats up on us, you know, <laughs> you can hear us complain. Kevin says as the owner of three restaurants, uh, it's stressful. Including locations in West Palm and Del Rey, there's one thing Linda could do. I said, hey, if you have the means and, and want to pay it forward, just go out to a local restaurant, tip the staff, take care of an independent restaurant. How does it make you feel to know that your act of kindness made somebody's year? It really makes you look at your priorities in life and what truly matters. That there's more to life than money and um, we need to take care of each other. This Christmas Eve, Linda is taking the long drive on I-95 from New York to see her parents in Boca. Kevin will be her first stop. And I'm gonna hug him from 10 feet away <laughs> with my mask and I'm gonna tip his staff and eat all his food. So, you know, I think everybody needs a little bit more kindness and compassion and, and help right now. Like the world needed to hear this story right now that there's still very, very good people out there. T.A. Walker, WPTV, News Channel 5. What an amazing story. People from hundreds and hundreds of miles away coming together this holiday season. Well, you can also help us highlight people making a difference in the community. Just send an email to inspiringsfl at wptv.com.